Welcome. It's such a blessing to come to you again. In this video, I want you to declare that it's your miracle day. Before we start praying, I want to share some scriptures and deliver a powerful message to guide our prayers. Some of what I say might be challenging for some, but it's the truth. Many Christians are hesitant to fight for what's rightfully theirs. They often lament their situations instead of taking action. But remember, promises are claimed by the brave. This message is meant to motivate and challenge you. In Matthew 11 to 12, it says, From the days of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom of heaven has been subjected to violence, and violent people have been raiding it. This verse is profound. If you meditate on it deeply, it will transform your perspective. Many don't claim their blessings because they aren't assertive enough. But blessings don't have specific names attached to them. They are for those who seek and claim them with faith. Let's begin. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, we come before your throne of grace and mercy. We recognize the power of your anointing, and we desire it more than ever. We rebuke every form of passivity that has held us back from walking in the fullness of your promises. Your word declares that we should be ever increasing, ever growing, and ever moving forward. We refuse to be stagnant or passive in our spiritual journey. Lord, we declare that we are not just bystanders in your kingdom. We are active participants, warriors, and intercessors. We will not be silenced by the enemy or held back by our past mistakes. We will shout against every barrier, every mountain, and every stronghold that tries to hinder our progress in you. Father, we declare that we are anointed by you. If no one else will anoint us, we will anoint ourselves in faith knowing that the true anointing comes from a heart surrendered to you and a life dedicated to serving. We understand that the anointing isn't in the oil but in the act of submission and obedience to your will. We speak against every form of stagnation in our lives. We declare growth, progress, and movement. We will not be held back by our past or by the voices of naysayers. We will move forward pursuing the promises you have for us with vigor and determination. We speak to every dry bone in our lives, every area of barrenness, and we command life. We declare that springs of living water will flow from us, refreshing those around us and bringing glory to your name. Lord, we take authority over every sickness, every disease, and every infirmity. We declare healing and wholeness in the name of Jesus. We rebuke every spirit of infirmity and command it to leave our bodies. We declare that we are healed by the stripes of Jesus. We speak to our past and declare that it has no hold over our future. We are new creations in Christ, and old things have passed away. We will not be defined by our past mistakes or failures but by your love, grace, and purpose for our lives. Father, we declare that we are warriors in your kingdom. We will fight the good fight of faith, and we will not back down. We will pursue our enemies until they are defeated, and we will take back everything the enemy has stolen from us. We thank you, Lord, for your faithfulness, for your love, and for your power at work in us. We declare that we are more than conquerors through Christ who strengthens us. We will walk in victory, and we will see your promises manifest in our lives. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. Type Amen if you feel abundant. Watch this important message right now.